Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm gonna do a reading on Anne Marie. Some of you may know her, some of you may not. I discovered her from SoundCloud actually. I just heard I heard one of her songs and I was like, oh, this girl is nice. And then I just been following her ever since. I remember when I used to have her as a Facebook friend, it was crazy. And then her sister died, RIP to her sister. I think she was um I think she was signed to Lil Durk's company, OTF. I think it's Lil Durk or one of these rappers that's from Chicago. Um, yeah, so let's get right into it. Hershey coming out with some new music. I might just do intuitive or I might do cards. It just depends what spirit really wants. But let's do an update on her. Let's see. Let's see what's going on with her. So the first thing I see is, I know y'all gonna say I see pregnancy. I do see pregnancy though. I do. I see pregnancy. I actually do see pregnancy, and her stomach is gonna be so tiny because she's tiny. I see. Her, I don't see her getting big for this pregnancy. She's gonna be very, very small. In regards to music, I, I feel like it's on and off. Like, one minute she gonna be focused on music. One minute she gonna try to start her out her, her own business outside of music. Some of these artists, they do music because the fans love it. it. Music doesn't really pay, to be honest. Music doesn't really pay. You can ask any artist out right now. That's upcoming. I mean, that's no, no, that's not upcoming. That's in the game right now. They would say music is not, it's not giving what's supposed to give. They passionate about it. They like it, but it's not giving what's supposed to give. The money is not there. Money is somewhere else. Like, say, real estate or, say, um, a hair company, a t-shirt line, clothing line. Yeah, so she may dibble and dabble in something else. Is she going to go to jail? I feel like she's going to be on probation. Or she's probably on probation right now. I don't know. No, but I don't think the trial started. So I, I don't know. Maybe Spirit's talking ahead of me. So they talking right they talking through me right now so i see probation i don't see her locked up and i see a community service like she's gonna have to do community service she can't really talk about the case but she may throw a little eh in there like this is what happened this is really what happened i like emory like she's so low-key i think she's a scorpio like me is she a scorpio i think she's a scorpio like me you know how we are the best to do ever do it <laughs> But, yes, I see she may talk about what happened that night at the hotel. But she's not going to say everything because that could incriminate her. So she got to be smart. But she may throw a little, like a little subliminal. It's weird that we, we didn't hear if the guy survived or or if, he, um, if he's dead. God forbid. But we didn't hear nothing. We just heard Anne-Marie went to jail. Emory spent months. Emory's out. School spirituality predicted she's coming out. She shot somebody in the head. How's she coming out of jail? She shot somebody in the head. She's on bond. I don't know. It's, it's weird. It's weird. Mm -hmm. I guess she have a good lawyer. <laughs> she have a good defense. A legal seat. Legal um, system. Legal team. I said legal system. Legal team. Because you shoot somebody in the head and you coming out? That's crazy. But we, to be honest, we don't know the full story because the media could be lying, right? The media could be definitely lying. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna use some cards to see what I get. I keep picking up this child. I don't know. Maybe the person's acting. I don't know something about a child. Either she has a child, or she's gonna have a child. The person she shot has a child, or maybe there was they've been friends for for a long time since childhood. Something about a child, or maybe a new beginning, a new start. Maybe they was playing around, goofing around, playing with the gun, and it just went all by mistake. Maybe it's back in childish. Like, yeah, cause the child could be a lot of different things, right? But I'm going to use cards to see what's kind of for Anne Marie. I'm going to do her love life, her career, and anything else Spirit want me to know. So there was a person in her life who she bent backwards for. It could be this person that she shot. She bent her ass backwards for. Now I don't mean to joke around. I'm not why I'm joking around right now, but I don't know. Spirit is laughing. <laughs> it's not me, guys. If I'm laughing, if I'm being disrespectful, sometimes my spirits will do crazy shit like that. But she bent her she bent her back backwards for someone. And 
So I guess she bent her she bent her back for someone and they didn't give her the same same treatment. It's like that person, whoever this person is, chose a bro before her. Or chose someone else before her. And she she don't play like that. She's like she's ready to smoke you if you try to play her like that. Don't ever try to play so the she want loyalty overall. She has a song called Loyalty. She want loyalty. F love. She want loyalty. Because you could you could love someone but not be loyal to them. But if you're loyal to someone, that means you love them. Because you're loyal to them. That's how she feels. And I feel her. I don't know about shooting the person. I don't know what the case is about. But allegedly she shot someone in the head. Back again, they was tussling. Like, that's the vision I'm getting. Tussling, tussling, fighting over the gun. All right, it's making sense, guys. It's making sense. Spirit is picking, like, putting all the pieces together. Spirit is saying someone was flirting with the ops, whether it was her flirting with the ops or him flirting with the ops. So, Spirit told me again, it was him. He was flirting with the ops. Like, he was just flirting with the ops. Like, <laughs> that's all either yeah that's all i guess he was playing with the hops and he they had a conversation like they were sitting on the t- I, I see the it's crazy i'm seeing like everything right now in my third eye like spirit is replaying what happened that night like they had a conversation it was her and him i don't know if somebody else was in the house, in the room but it was him, her and him and they had a conversation and, and i guess it was a gun there and they had a conversation and she probably called him out like you hide behind a mask you're not real you no loyalty you're not showing me no loyalty you're an op and i got they was tussling with the gun but it still don't make sense to me my 3d my 3d self she tussling with the gun and the go that's what like, i guess the report said she was tussling with the like she had the gun and i guess they was fighting over the gun and it shot him in the head. I don't know. Like, this story is crazy. Really crazy. And it's sad because some he got shot in the head. He might not ever be the same. But hopefully, God willing, he's able to be back to himself. I'm also getting money was involved. I don't... This, is, this story is starting crazy and crazy. Don't tell me it's like a setup. I don't know. I got to dig more deep. But I'm getting like... Somebody was holding somebody something over somebody's head, like, oh, I give you money if, or take this thing and I and you could do this for me because, like, stuff something like that. All right, it's making sense, guys. It's making sense. Spirit is picking, like, putting all the pieces together. Spirit is saying someone was flirting with the ops, whether it was her flirting with the ops, or him flirting with the ops. So, Spirit told me again, it was him. He was flirting with the ops. Like, he was just flirting with the ops. Like, that's, that's all. Either, yeah, that's all I guess. He was flirting with the ops. And he, they had a conversation. Like, they were sitting on the... T- I, like, I see the... It's crazy. I'm seeing, like, everything right now in my third eye. Like, Spirit is replaying what happened that night. Like, they had a conversation. It was her and him. I don't know if somebody else was in the, house, in the room. But it was him, her and him, and they had a conversation, and I guess it was a gun there. And they had a conversation, and she probably called him out like, you hide behind a mask, you're not real, you no loyalty, you're not showing me no loyalty, you're an op. And I got they was tussling with the gun. I don't know why I said that analogy, but I'm getting like that. They probably been cool for a long time. I think, was, I think that was her childhood best friend. And the more time she spent with him, the more time she fell for him, or the more time he spent with her, the more time he fell for her. Because I keep getting her saying, I love it when you text me. And he's like, I want you back. Like, what? What type of shit is that? Like, that was your best friend. But, um, no. Uh, let's see what else I get. Ah, it's making more sense, guys. So, that's so what I'm getting. It could be vice versa, him or her. I'm getting a love triangle <laughs> that's what i'm fucking getting guys fucking love triangle or a triangle of the ops i'm getting the ops the tri- a triangle a love triangle that's what i'm getting shit is crazy i, w- I really want to know what's gonna happen like oh i got ask i forgot i'm psychic <laughs> but i really don't know like what happened that night like why did it happen it was uncalled for but what the hell like why i feel the guy she shot allegedly because i don't know if she shot him because we don't know this whole story we wasn't there we was not there so we can't point fingers 
You can't say nothing because you wasn't there. They say you innocent until proven guilty, right? So, anywho, I feel like this guy loved her. I feel like he loved Anne Marie. Like he was like in love with Anne Marie. And regardless of what happened, he forgives Anne Marie and he, he loves her. Like, that's his dog for life. No matter what she did to him, that's his dog for life. She's sticking, but he's sticking beside her. Like, that's his dog. So, in terms of her career, I see her partying. I see her having fun, getting lit. I see her blowing up more than she is now. Like, she's going to go viral for something. Either a song or something. I see, I see her, like, just in party mode. Just having fun. Living life. So, hot girl summer. I'm also getting she's praying to God. Or she has, she, she changed her religion. Or she's more religious. Something about religion. So, overall, I think that's all I get with Anne-Marie. Like, I pray for her. I pray that the truth comes out. But do we really have to know the truth? Like, it's none of our business. She's going to have to be the one to deal with this for the rest of her life. So, we don't really need to know the truth, right? But I pray for both parts. I pray for, I pray for the guy. Because... But then again, I don't, I don't know this. <laughs> I, pray for, I pray for everybody. I just pray for everybody. Everybody need healing. Everybody need help. And I pray that she gets help. He gets help. And I don't know about rec- I, I, like he is like in the reading, it seems that he still want to talk to her. So he'll forgive her. But they're probably not going to be cool as how they used to be. Because people are going to be looking at her sideways like, you shot this man, now y'all cool? Like, what? That's crazy. But I pray for everyone. I pray for her success. I hope. I pray she just win. I pray everybody win. Everybody that's watching this, I pray you win too. <laughs> but overall, guys, thank you for watching my videos. I appreciate you guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. And follow me on Twitter, School Spirituality. I was about to say that biz. That's my website. If you want a reading, schoolspirituality.biz. And I catch you guys later.